Hello everyone, my name is Kristen Racine and I'm a volunteer at the Adams Observatory here at Austin College. I'm excited to kick off a series of videos we've produced to guide you on your own stargazing expeditions. Today we're going to take a look at the night sky as viewed from Sherman, Texas. I'm going to be pointing out some constellations that you may be able to see from your home in winter. Let's go on a tour of the night sky! I'm using a planetarium software called Stellarium, which you can access online, download to your computer for free, or purchase for your tablet or phone. Stellarium is displaying what a typical view of the night sky from Sherman might look like. I set the date and time to January 1st, 2021 at 7 p.m., but the constellations we'll be pointing out can be seen in the evening sky from late October to mid-February. Today we're going to take a look at the northern sky. One constellation that can be easy to spot is Cassiopeia. You can recognize this constellation by its W or M shape. Cassiopeia is an interesting constellation because it's circumpolar. This means that it circles around the North Celestial Pole which points at the star Polaris, or the North Star. Cassiopeia never fully sets, meaning that it never fully drops below the ground here in Sherman, so we can see it in the night sky more frequently than some of the other constellations. Also, the wider part of the W always faces towards Polaris, so you can use this to help you find North. Moving higher up in the sky, away from the ground and a bit to the east. We can find another constellation near Cassiopeia called Perseus. Perseus's constellation looks like a person holding up their arm. Here's the arm, and here are the legs. The swoop shape of the arm is one of the easiest ways to find Perseus. The last two constellations we'll look at today are connected. Looking to the west of Cassiopeia, we can find Pegasus and Andromeda. Pegasus is most easily spotted by this square of stars here, which you can imagine as the body of a horse. The neck and head of the horse are off of this top left star here. And off of the bottom left star are the two front legs of the horse. Andromeda makes up the back legs of the horse here. Inside of the area of the constellation Andromeda is the Andromeda Galaxy, which is the galaxy that is closest to ours. We hope you've enjoyed this tour of the winter sky in Sherman, Texas. See if you can find some of these constellations the next time you're out at night. Is there something that you'd like to see in our next video? Do you have a question or something you want to learn about? Let us know!